Welcome to High Tea with Grace, where we spill the tea on HIT. I'm thrilled to be at Vive 2024 today, speaking with the industry's greatest leaders about the industry's greatest problems and the solutions that are solving those problems. I'll also be learning about leadership strategies that keep these leaders at the top of their game. All right, tea up. Absolutely, it's so great to be here with you, Grace. Um, it's always a pleasure, and Vive is such a great venue to be at. My name is Cindy Gaines, and I am the Chief Clinical Transformation Officer for Lumion. I am a nurse, and i um, been a nurse for almost 37 years, so I, I love healthcare, and I love, I love nursing, and I'm so happy to be part of Vive. Thank you so much for joining me today. So tell me a little bit about what you feel to be the industry's greatest challenge. You know, when I think about the industry and where we're at today, our greatest challenges, they really kind of, it's hard to put it in one, I would say, the number one challenge on my part is the staffing. We're just the staffing crisis that we're dealing with. It was short when we went in to COVID. Coming out of it, it's just, it's so much worse than we ever expected. You know, we saw this coming when I was working leading magnet organizations. 15 years ago, we were planning for when our nurses were, were gonna retire our average age at our hospital. At that point, it was 48. We knew we were gonna have this great retirement. What happened is, it just happened so much more quickly than we expected with COVID. And so we're dealing with that. And that challenge of that, I'm gonna say, and let's put on top of that, it's just the financial crisis we're in. So what we need to address the staffing challenges is very difficult to address when there's not the money to pay for it. So the two of them together are kind of like the perfect storm of where we're at in healthcare. And it's just a really hard place to be. Interesting. You know, I'd also love to learn more about what innovations are solving those challenges. So when I think about innovations that can help, we need to really look at innovations that can unburden the team. We've spent, I've spent my whole career, you know, when it was, we needed to do something new, we handed it to a staff person. Have Susie call, um, have so-and-so reach out to that patient, send a letter to their home. We need to look at automation and unburdening and, and look at those, we're not gonna get to where we need to go doing it the way we've always done it. And there aren't people to give it to anymore. We need to actually take things away and free them up to do what they came into healthcare to do, which is take care of patients. Nobody came in to, to, to manage more paperwork. So let's unburden them and let them take care of patients and, and, and work with their passions. Now, moving on to the personal side, what advice do you wish you could give your younger self? Oh, younger self. I would say my younger self advice would be to never take a job that you feel completely confident at. Um, I early in my career, I, you know, you'd go to, I wanted to do something I was completely confident at, I felt completely comfortable with, and you never grow in that way. And so always take a job that's a little bigger than you, that you kind of question, can I really do it? Because I'm going to tell you when you do that, you grow like by leaps and bounds. And it, you just, you'll, you'll go places you never expected. And I learned that in the middle of my career as opposed to early on. So that would be my early on advice. Thank you so much for joining us today. We loved learning from you. And thanks to you for joining us too. Check out the High Tea with Grace podcast website and YouTube page for more great guests like the one today. Cheers. Cheers.